beautiful friends. I'm just popping on here real quick to do a little 2.0 video to my Timu Eye video. So if you're new here, welcome to my channel. This is Nova Gnome Creations and I'm Nova. And there is actually a part one video to this where I do, where I had a lot more safety eyes I was looking at, but I went ahead and grabbed a couple more. So these are from Timu. Um, I did purchase these with my own monies, but I do also have an affiliate link, which I will uh, put in the description box. If you do end up heading over there, I would love it if you use my affiliate link. I also have a little code if you would like to use that, and that can get you some coupons, so you can get a little bit of a discount. And then I'll also link these safety eyes in the description box also, if you want like a direct link to them. So the first thing, actually, I'm going to start with these ones because uh, these were the reason that I'm making this video for the most part. Uh, one of the safety eyes that I was looking for when I made my Timu order were the off-center pupil eyes. And I got some that I thought were supposed to be off-center pupils and then they ended up not really being off-center pupils. Um, they were a little bit more like the um, kind of dragon eye sort of shape or cat eye sort of shape. So I got some new ones and these ones appear to actually be off center pupils. Yes. So let me pop a color behind it so you can get a better look. Oop. So these ones are just green. Um, like I was saying before, if you have uh, safety eyes with these little colored discs that you put behind them, you could just change them out so even if you buy like for example I bought like a pack of green ones I have sparkly discs for other safety eyes of this size so I could actually do any color I want oh yay they are so I got my off-center pupil eyes Woo uh, very excited about that um, I think that these can just like be very like cutesy you know depending on how you use them very kawaii kind of eyes. You can kind of give that image of looking to the side or you could have them kind of spread out to make like a wonky face or kind of tilted in to make like a little bit of a innocent kind of derpy face. I just feel like these off-center pupils offer a little bit like more of a range of emotion than just like, you know, a typical regular pupil in the middle. So I'll set those to the side. And then I had to get these. I have been wanting to get some of these. Um, these are red safety eyes, which I thought were perfect for Halloween. I'm actually about to use some of these for a Halloween make. But these are red pupils. And they don't come with any colored discs. They're just clear, um, which I honestly feel like adds to the creepy factor of them that they've just kind of... They'll just kind of have like a little bit of a cloudy sort of look of the color of whatever the the yarn behind it is. Um, but they also have like a red post on them. So I don't know. I think they're cool. I think they're really different. Um, and these will be great for like demons and just like other kind of spooky things. And then also I was thinking you could totally put a disc behind these and make them colored eyes um, if you wanted to. I don't know how that would look. You could do green. I mean, obviously these aren't the right size because these are two different color or two different sizes of safety eye. But like, I wonder if this will even show anything. This will probably fit up here, but it'll be smaller than the um, eye actually is. But let's see. Oh yeah, you can get the idea. So like if you did like red and green, you could totally do like a Christmassy look. But like wouldn't these be so cool for like, you know, something like a little demon or something like that? Totally digging that green sparkle actually. <laughs> that would be fun for a Christmassy look. Uh, or like a spooky, spooky look. I wonder if I have any like black ones of these. That would be cool. But yeah, so I did go ahead and find some uh, off-center pupil eyes and I will link those down in the description box for you guys because I know that uh, some of you guys were also interested in these. Um, where'd the one go that I put the back on? There it is. I know some of you guys were also interested in these, so I'll pop those down in the description and I wanted to share these with you, uh, you know, because I think that they're fun to do like, I don't know, like just a very different type of safety eye, you know? 
gives you uh, more options. And I love having all of the options. Like, give me all the different safety eyes. But yeah, they both came from Timu. And like I said, I'll link them down below. Uh, I hope you guys are having a beautiful rest of your day. Uh, don't forget, I am doing my 13 days of yarn ween um, every day for, you know, 13 days. So this is just a little bonus video. Make sure you pop over there to see the full, you know, shebang videos. <laughs> all right, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Bye. We'll